So in the early hours of the morning last night, Power World received its latest patch of version 0.1.5.0. This has been released already on Steam and as of right now, I'm guessing probably later on today, it will release on Xbox. Today we go through all the patch notes and this is definitely the biggest patch they have dropped so far. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and before we go any further, I'm giving away a couple of copies of this game or any game of your choice. To be with a chance of winning, simply drop a like on the video, leave a comment down below and make sure you are subbed. Winners are picked from the comment section and I will announce them at the end of the week. So good luck everybody. Okay, so the patch notes, these are pretty hefty, so let's check them out. Okay, so starting with major fixes. Implemented backup of saved data on the world selection screen. Resolved issue of unnecessary data accumulating in save data. Now, I know many players are having issues in regards to saving, especially on that Xbox. So I'm hoping this kind of fixes something, but I'm not sure it will, but we will see. Key configuration. Added fully supported keyboard key configuration. Okay, pretty cool. Guild. Modified specification to allow guild members to be removed when not logged in. Play issues. Change long press operation during player tasks to allow continuous work by pressing a work button once. This is switchable in the option settings. That's actually quite a good change. Fixed an issue where riding in prohibited hunting areas would not result in a crime. I actually had that a few times, I'm not going to lie. Improved interaction accuracy with adjacent objects. Okay, so moving on to PALs. Change specification so that when a PAL is instructed to attack aggressively, the PAL will attack enemies indiscriminately even if they are not in combat. That's also a good change. Corrected an issue to allow PALs of a rank 1 or higher to be selected as concentrated material. Higher rank pals yield more points when concentrated. This makes more sense, obviously the condensation machine, if you have a power that's already been condensed into with other pals, he will offer more points in regards to being used as concentration material. Okay, so fix the bug where if a large amount of experience points were gained and the level increased to 50 at once, pals would not learn any active skills. Ooh. Mitigated an issue where using Masanda's partner skill, Grenade Deer Panda, on a dungeon boss would cause the boss to get stuck in walls. Okay, so now we're going to move on to base issues. Fix an issue where base powers will get stuck on top of a logging site. Man, oh man. Yeah, it says etc. because it's not just logging sites either. This is a pain in my ass. Okay, so added measures to prevent the issue where base powers would wander around and get stuck at the border of the base area. Yes, another issue I had continuously, especially my anubises. Okay, so fix an issue where powers at the base will get stuck repeatedly, starting transportation tasks, and a light bulb icon will appear over and over again. Another one I've experienced, I'm pretty sure all these what we're going to go through we've all experienced. Okay, so next up we have added measures to prevent the issue of base powers getting stuck in the farm on a roof. Yep, again, I've had this issue too. Uh, fix an issue where work powers will get stuck in the summon place of a power box when we're starting the server on a dedicated server. Yes, uh, yep, this is me, 100%. Adjusted the default work priority of base powers, Anubis will prioritize manual labor. Pretty cool, actually. Now, this was a system I actually always wondered if it was in the game. If a power had a higher work suitability stat in one thing, would that power prioritize that task? So it seems as though they're actually working towards this. So pretty cool. Okay, so moving on and significantly relaxed building restrictions for stairs and triangular roofs. Uh, pretty cool. This is a good fix for that. Many people have no problems with stairs, me being one of them. Fix an issue where sand would play in an infinite loop when pals at the base use certain active skills. Specifications change so that all changes in environmental temperature are added up. If you put four campfires next to each other, the surrounding area will have a temperature of a volcano. So this will obviously affect how you breed now in regards to the egg incubation. Sometimes they feel warm, sometimes they feel cold. Obviously now using campfires to warm said egg up will work now because you could put 20 campfires around an egg before and it would make no damn difference. So that's a good change. Okay, so implemented relaxed working style and a monitoring stand. Oh, cool. Can't wait to try that out. 
Okay, so now we're going to move on to balance adjustment. Significantly strengthened mining power of dig toys partner skills. Oh, that's pretty cool because I actually built up my own dig toys who's super overpowered already. I mean, I bred him from quite a line of good powers with good passives. Uh, so I can't wait to get and actually try this dude. Fixed abnormally high selling price of nails. Oh no, they've fixed it, they've patched it, people. We can't get rich anymore. To be honest, making gold in this game is so easy. I don't think you need to rely on nails. There's so many other ways of getting so much money. So yeah, guys, yeah. That ain't too much of a problem in my opinion. Significantly increased the number of police officers who appear when a crime is committed. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I'm thinking I'm going to read further on down here, guys, at the Fix the Tower Boss uh, capture glitch. Or maybe not, we'll see. Added electric shock effect to free power alliances crossbow. Okay. Adjusted the flight distance of sphere launcher and scatter sphere launchers. Okay, cool. Increased the sand value recovery amount of high quality hot springs. That's a great change, it really is. Okay, so now we're going to move on to network related. Renovated the server lobby. Search by name will now work. Or search by server name as it states here. Added the ability to view online players on a dedicated server. On community servers, this will only be displayed if the setting is enabled. Okay, so now we move on to others. Fix the issue where day five memo was not placed. You can now adjust the in-game brightness in these settings. Fix many minor bugs. Corrected various incorrect text. Improved measures against cheating. That's a big one for sure. And lastly, they say, guys, we are currently working on an issue where auto save fails were on the Xbox and the Xbox Game Pass versions. We expect that this will be resolved in an upcoming update. So as I said at the start of the video, I was hoping this would be a problem that got fixed. I mean, you know what? They tweeted out something last week and I replied to it saying that many, many players on Xbox are having this issue, uh, that they're having an issue with not being able to, the auto save don't work. So the world is not saving basically. And I got attacked. I legit got attacked by other powered players saying, oh, this is a you problem. This has happened to me on my Xbox. I've been fine since day one, etc., etc. The abuse I got for sticking up for people on Xbox, even though I'm playing this game on PC and haven't encountered any problems really, uh, I got abuse. I can't believe it, guys. So that's the last time I'm sticking up for people on Xbox on social media. I'm trying to get this thing fixed for many, many players who have stopped playing because of this, and yet I get attacked for it. It's, it's a wild world. We live in a wild world, people. But yes, that is the update. Of, let's go scroll back up to the top. I can't remember what it was version 0.1.5.0 and there we have it guys again as i make this video right now it's literally 11 a.m in the morning this was released early hours yesterday morning uh but it's the 27th of february uh, xbox version should be out by the time you probably watch this video but guys if you enjoyed it leaving a like it really helps out if you like what you see and want to see more power be sure to subscribe and hopefully guys i will see you on that next one